Good morning to you. What are we gonna do today? Do you want to play? You need breakfast? Welcome back to my channel guys, or if you're new here, welcome to my channel. Um, I am back and I'm so excited to be back. It has been, I think three months now of just go, go, go. So it's been really, really nice to be back. We've been back home for technically now two days, I believe. Here's Brex. So yeah, we so we got home from Washington. If you guys watched my last video, I will make sure to link that down below if you guys haven't. But I kind of explained that I don't know if I'm going to be recording videos when I go home to Washington for the summer. Brexy. No thank you. No thank you. Basically, I ended up not at all, um, which was really, really nice just to be able to spend time with family, friends, not feel like I had the pressure of having to record things and stuff like that. So, didn't end up filming any videos while I was home in Washington. And then we got home for about a week and then we went to Colorado for four days. So, we are finally home. We got back Tuesday. It's now Thursday. And we've just been resting and kind of adjusting to living at home again because we haven't really and so yeah it's good to see you guys um i figured there's not much going on with me and my and my family this week um so i'll just take you along with a little vlog today but next week Yay. miss girl brexley jean turns one on tuesday so we'll do a little birthday vlog or something of the sort that day so very excited um brexley yeah. looks so much bigger, I'm sure, from the last video. So I'm just gonna bring you guys along with me throughout the day and you can kind of see what it's like to just 
hang out after traveling for two months. So, um, I have my coffee made, so I'm going to sip on some coffee while Brexley plays. She just got done drinking a bottle, and then I'll get up and make some breakfast. But we like to have our bottle, have our coffee, and then kind of let it settle and then make breakfast. It's just easier for us, but soon Brexley won't be on formula anymore. We'll transfer to whole milk, um, starting... Well, you can start when you're a year old, but you kind of wean them off. So I'm just slowly weaning her off. She's already weaned off a bottle. So um, it's been pretty easy so far for us as far as the weaning off formula. So yeah, I'm hoping very soon we are not paying for formula anymore, but we shall see. If we have to, we have to. I will do whatever it takes to obviously get her the nutrients she needs. With that, I'm going to sit here, sip on my coffee, let Brexley play, and kind of just hang out until... It's time for breakfast, so I will see you guys then. Okay, so for breakfast we are doing, well I'm doing a breakfast burrito and then Rex is just going to do eggs and cheese and a strawberry and I think that's it for her so we have been doing baby led weaning since Brexley was six months when you can start it and I love it I love it <laughs> um I like either like whether we did purees or if we did baby led weaning I'd be fine either way but I just did it because I thought why not she eats very well. She loves a lot of things. There's not a lot of things she doesn't like. Eggs with cheese and then a strawberry. Okay, here is breakfast. Don't come at me. I do not know how to wrap a burrito. Coffee and then water. All right. It is about nap time for Brexley, which means we need to get her dressed for the day and then she'll go down for a nap and then I can finally get ready. It is 10:19. We don't get started till later. <laughs> It's just how our days go. Um, and that's okay. Today, we are going to wear... What are we going to wear, Brex? <laughs> just a little onesie. <laughs> These are from Walmart. Nope, just kidding. Sorry, this is Target Cat and Jack. <laughs> brand, super comfy. And like, I love them. Um, Walmart has ones very similar though. And I think they're like under $5. Turn on your sound machine. Turn it on. Good job. Okay, you guys, I am ready for the day, and we need to, okay, we need to get all this stuff for Brexley's birthday ready. These are like tassels, like this, and I'm going to put them on her high chair when she does her little cake smash thing, and then I got this one balloon that I'll take some pictures of her with, and then this candle for her cake, which I need to... I'm debating if I want to make it or not. I don't know if I trust myself with that. But then this is what I was showing you guys is this photo banner with like goes from newborn up until 12 months. So I need to print some photos so that we can hang this somewhere for decoration on her birthday. But I just want to get this done and over with because I didn't know that they came all individually. I don't know if you guys can tell. Three different colors. But then you put them all together and I didn't realize that they were individually like this. I thought they came made. So... This is going to be a little project for me. Rexley's still napping. So this is my job for the day. Also, I wanted to show you guys that small business. This is the hair clip. And then I also got these for Brexley. These little like alligator clips. Super, super pretty. This is her, where is it? I don't know if you guys can see this. Her information. It's called Bloom Head Wraps, excuse me, on Instagram. And their stuff is amazing. So I will definitely be putting those on bricks. Update, this is not happening. This is too much work. So we ordered a different one. And uh, we're going with that one because it's pre-made. Because this is insane. Like I don't even know how this is supposed to work. And it's also a lot larger than I thought. It is expecting it to be shorter like that. So we will just not use these okay i also do just need to show this set real quick that i got for brex from amazon i will link it down below it is this cute romper 
It's so cute. And then just these little white sandals. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait. Um, this will be linked in my storefront. So if you want to look at it, go check it out. And also there's a ton of other like cute clothes and stuff that I've gotten for Brexley or I want to get for Brexley in my storefront. Okay, I'm back. I was actually at Target and I will do a little haul of what I got. But we have Brex here. Say hi to the camera. Hey. <laughs> and we need to do her hair just to get her somewhat ready for the day. Let's do it. Let's see. We need... Where's your spray bottle? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa. Okay, let's get your hair. So, look at how long her hair is. Okay, let's separate it. Go like this. She's trying to comb her hair. Is that not the cutest thing ever? <gasps> wow! <laughs> Beautiful! Gotta do that Target haul. So, found this gift wrap at Target. Pretty cheap. Um, it's the gold dots on the craft paper. I don't... I really need to figure out how to... Ah, look at that. You can see that? Cool. Um, then I just got like this ribbon to wrap around the gift. One day I'll get this down. Okay, there you go. And then lastly I got uh, tags for the gifts just to make it all cute and fancy. Um, and then command strips which I'll show you after this. But first we need to wrap these gifts. Perfect. Just like that. Okay, here's the thing. So I got these command hooks for this. Now this is like a huge necklace holder rack or whatever. And I got it because um, I just don't have anything to hold my necklaces. And I feel like it's not the cutest, but it was super cheap on Amazon. I think this will be perfect for hanging up all my necklaces. Um, but I never, I don't have hooks. I don't really want to drill anything into the wall. So I'm going to see if command hooks will keep it up. I am worried because it's felt. I don't know if felt will stick to it, or if it will stick to felt, but we will see. So let's attempt this. I'm kind of nervous. It looks so good. See, sometimes you've just got to do function over beauty and whatever that saying is. What is it? Function over something. Here is your helpful tip if you have bananas that are going old. Split them in half and freeze them because they are perfect for smoothies. Is that nummy? Do you like it? All right, you guys. I have been so in and out of the house today. It is insane. I'm typically never out of the house, so this is a lot for me. I went to Target because I had to get the, the birthday stuff. And then I was bored, so I went to Savers, which is our local thrift store. Actually, it may be more than local, but it's the only one I can find around me right now, so I call it our local. And I wanted to do a little thrift haul because I found some good finds, I think. And so let's just do that real quick. Um, oh yeah, and then I went to Albertsons because I had to get more groceries because I forgot to get them at Target. So it's been a lot of in and out, but here we go. First one, this cute romper. Super cute from Old Navy. Super, super cute. Um, well, it's not buttoned, but it's like a little romper from H&M. And it's this really light, it's like light teal almost color. So adorable. This is a newborn. So there's only one thing I got that actually fits Brexley, but I feel like I like to just get stuff for boys if we ever have a boy. And if we don't, then we give it to a friend or something, but I can't pass the clothes without getting them so and then this is from Oshkosh it's this little jean romper onesie I just can't get over it it's so cute I think this could go with a boy or a girl honestly I don't think it actually has to go with just boy sorry you guys can hear bricks in the background these are super cute little khaki pants for a boy and then this is my favorite hey what are you doing center bouncer this 49ers turtleneck onesie this is the cutest thing I've ever seen and then lastly for me I found this these quarter zips that I've been looking at at Target these ones I don't know if you've seen them I'll make sure to link down below but these quarter zips that they still sell for five dollars 
Uh, scissors. Okay, okay, okay. Good job! Good job, do it again. Boogian is roaresome, but he might step on your feet. So tonight we are having the healthiest dinner we have ever had. Um, just kidding. But I have no shame because some nights you just don't want to cook and this is how you do it. Marcus gets his own and I get my own and then if we have leftovers we have lunch the next day. Brexley is not having pizza. She's going to have some more of this for lunch. It's like a ground beef corn rice all mixed together. Uh, she had it for lunch also, but we'll give that to her again. Some potato salad, and I'm gonna cut up a little bit of tomato and give it to her. She loves tomato, so never mind. I'm not giving her what's it called? Potato salad. I'm gonna do fruit. A piece of cantaloupe. Because I know she likes cantaloupe, and she should probably have a fruit. We are ending the vlog with this wonderful lighting because there's no other way to do it. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Brixley is down for the night now, which means we get in our comfy clothes, we have dessert, and we watch a movie. It's my favorite part of the day. So with that, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like this, give it a like. If you guys have any videos you want to see from me that I have not done yet, um, comment those down below. If you guys want to keep up with me daily, go follow my Instagram. I'll make sure to put that in the, in the description box. And I will see you guys later. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.